Hey guys, what's up? In this video, we'll take a look at how to create or optimize our proxy media files for smoother editing in Final Cut Pro. We've all seen this before. Choppy playback, drop frames pop-up window, or waiting for what seems like an eternity while Final Cut Pro renders files every time you make a cut in your project. You may be running a slightly underpowered machine or trying to edit a highly compressed video format. Either way, using optimized or proxy media may help. There's two ways you can create optimized or proxy media files for your clips. First, when importing your media, you are given an option to create these files. Choosing to create optimized media converts your footage into a very editor-friendly format with virtually no quality loss. The only downside is your optimized files are very large, so if storage is an issue, you may want to consider proxy files. Proxy files, on the other hand, are quite a bit smaller and are also a very friendly format for editing. The downside to proxy files is these files are about one-fourth of the resolution of the original. This will only affect your video while editing, and you can always switch back to the original media before export so the finished product quality will not suffer. The second way to transcode your media files is in your media browser after your files have been imported. Right click on your clip in the media browser and select transcode media. Next select whether you want to create optimized media, proxy media or both and hit ok. To switch between optimized and proxy media from the view drop down menu select your preferred format. And keep in mind when using proxy media in your project you have to switch back to original media before export. Otherwise, you'll export the lower quality proxy files. Hopefully creating these media files helps with editing your next project. If you enjoyed this video, make sure to let me know in the comments or by hitting the like button. And check out the rest of my channel for more Final Cut Pro tutorials. Thanks for watching and I'll see you next time.